I'm here at AHR 2023. <laughs> it just happens. You, know, you just mash the button and you go live. AHR 2023 Atlanta. And I'm here with Alex from Minotaur. I actually met Alex, uh, I think, last summer, I think. Um, building summer camp. Building summer camp, yeah. Josie Bricks. And uh, show. It, was a, Event. it was a new uh, concept that I was not fully familiar with. It's similar to some other things I've seen before. And that is uh, your company, Minotaur. Yep. Um, so just kind of broadly, before we even get into that, just tell us a little bit about you, and then we'll get into Minotaur. Um, I've been in the HVC manufacturing business since 2006. I used to work for Fantex System Air back in back in Quebec and Canada, where I'm from, explaining my funky accent. Um, and uh, since uh, early 2016, I'm luckily uh, co-owner of Minotaire, which is a HVC manufacturer based in Gatineau, Quebec, so two hours west of Montreal, just beside Ottawa. This is where we design, do our or on R&D and manufacturing of our all-in-one HVAC D units, which which is you know a, a, a one unit, which is in reality a ducted heat pump, but with with some twist, proving it to be the most efficient of all HRC ERVs in terms of heat recuperation, because we're using a technique which been known for decades in commercial industrial application, using a heat pump component to capture. The heat from the stale air, but on top of that, we're also capturing the heat from the stale air, uh, the heat, sorry, from the moisture on top of the heat from the stale air, and the compressor being inside that one single box with no outdoor units, we are able to grab about a thousand BTUs of free heat. So we work with three heat sources. This is why that the HVI, when uh, we went for certification, as I, when our machine was sent to the third party lab, you know, in Mississauga. Uh, well, we have the highest sensible recovery efficiency ever seen. You know, we've bested everybody with, you know, passive cores. And before saying, say, yeah, but you're running a compressor, but the SRE doesn't give, doesn't mind if you're running more electricity or what. It's, right. So the SRE is in reality a ratio where when you're using a machine, how much electricity you're using, compressor included in our case, because the CSCF R29 standard on the, behind HVI permits, you know, machines like ours to be tested. For fresh air and recuperation, meaning that in our case, the ACR is 116 percent. So people say, hey, we thought that the limit was 100 percent, but we have to understand that it isn't really a ratio. A ratio where, in reality, how much electrical energy are you, the unit is using, like I said, compressor included, and versus how much heat unit energy are you capturing. In our case, even if we run a compressor once in a while, we get, we're getting so much heat that it does explain you know, that higher number. So, okay, you jumped way ahead, oh, which yeah. was great, and that's so that's good. So for <laughs> our building science, building performance uh, nerds, they're going to be like, all right, I'm with them here. I think you lost like 90% of the HVAC audience. So we'll backtrack let's a bit. back it up. Yeah. All right, so yeah. very simply. Very in, simply. In the what we do? the way that you can describe this unit, what does it do? So our unit, you know, we mostly sell those units in multifamily buildings, and we call that the Pantacare series. So... It's a white box with four top ports. You install that just like a big HRV ERV, even if it's a heat pump, because it's self and self, you know, it's self-contained, all the components is under one box. So installation-wise, there's no outside unit, no refrigeration line to install. So you inst so even if it's a heat pump, it's machine, you install that just like a big HRV. When I say big HRV, you're gonna use eight-inch ductwork instead of six inch because we move on a regular basis 250 CFM. So installation wise, the moment you have someone who's good doing rigid duct work, you know, you're golden, all is good. You know, there's no big difference. You know, uh, the only thing we ask is to have before before each supply registers and exhaust registers, three feet of a product that we call the acoustic air, which is a semi-flexible acoustic duct to reduce, you know, uh, the sounds to make a quieter installation. That's it. So it's very simple installation wise. And actually, Minotaur is for that kind of concept of a decentralized system where you install one machine per apartment instead of having a rooftop equipment, you know, uh, where in the case of a VR system, you're going to have, you know, line, miles of, of lines of refrigerant crossing floors. For a rooftop ERV, you're going to have, you know, same thing, duct crossing all the floors. In our case, it's we're rooftop liberators. You know, you want to put more PV panels on the top, not a problem because we, we will not take that space, right. you know. So, the, and also what is very lovable is the fact that all our projects, uh, our customers have on the premises one or two extra units in the basement as a backup unit. Because one, if one machine goes down, it's not the entire building going down. It's only one unit, you know, right. which is a big plus when they're building manager or building owner, you know. So, yeah. So, okay, so you're talking in terms of, uh, just to kind of give some context, 
in a lot of cases, commercial buildings, multifamily buildings, uh, that sort of thing, you're going to be bringing in outdoor air outdoor. and it's going to be on a rooftop unit. In this case, you're kind of you're kind of decentralizing. It. Exactly. So now exactly. it's it's a zonal approach, um, very high efficiency, and so now you're able to both control the moisture and the heat exchange, rather than just using kind of a traditional core where you have a heat exchange core. Yeah. You're actually using a heat pump component. You're using a compressor. You're circulating refrigerant, yeah. and you're moving heat in that way more efficiently. Yeah. yeah. So actually, we call that series the Panticare series because it takes care of five things. Fresh air with heat recuperation, again, with the highest heat recuperation numbers ever seen, certified by the AGVI. As a heat pump heating and cooling. Also, deemification. Those machines try by removing, you know, uh, about 100 uh, pints of moisture per day, which is a lot, you know. And, uh, sorry, 54, not, no, it's 112 liters, sorry. So about 54 uh, pints a day. Uh, and at the end, also, we each machine comes with a duo of, filter, of filters, one MERV-8 and a MERV-15. And MERV-15 is considered medical grade according to Ashley 170 because it starts at MERV-14 to be considered a medical grade filter. So, so yeah, so again, we take care of the fresh air with your corporation, so super comfortable. To give you an idea, at 32 Fahrenheit, if you move under at CFM, the fresh air exiting the unit, entering the, the apartment will be, you know, at will be at you know uh, at um, uh, at 39 Fahrenheit. Uh, sorry, not 39 Fahrenheit. Not Celsius, which is you know about 102 Fahrenheit, which is right. you're doing not only fresh air but also heating in the same case, you know, in the mild condition. Right, right. Unheard of. You know, yeah. So yeah, yeah. You can do a lot with it. It's a really super interesting technology. We got to talking about it and kind of started nerding out. So I guess the application is people who are and generally it's going to be more uh, you know throughout the us it's generally going to be people who are more interested in high performance type construction yeah absolutely right? this That's, is our niche this yeah. is our niche but what is high performance today as you know brian will be tomorrow right. you know be seven eight ten years from now code right so right now factually military is not only you know the pioneer but the leader and another brand leader in such you know so decentralized anti solution you know for multifamily buildings you know? yeah. nice so for people who want to find out more, especially, you know, maybe it's uh, design engineers, folks who are doing designs, contractors, thinking through some of this, what is the way for them to start to dip their toe in so they can learn more about um, some of your applications and some of your specifications? Yeah, sorry. Uh, pretty simple. Reach out at Minotaire.com. So M-I-N-O-T-A-I-R.com, you know. Uh, we are revamping our website right now, you know, but uh, to reach out to us is pretty easy send us an email you know or give it give us a call you know and we'll be able to take care of you and help you with your with your projects you know awesome is there anything else that i forgot to ask that's like in the in the basic uh, pitch that you're um i mostly i i solely talked about multifamily, but at the end but at the end of the day our machine is actually you know, actually one of the best machines to get as the best set of lungs for any house right. in terms of indoor quality you know what with, with the real effective demarcation the heat recuperation of fresh air and also that combo of MERV 8 and MERV 15 air filtration. And by the way, the MERV 15 has a rigid frame with a gasket. So we've got customers on the West Coast in the US and Canada during the wildfire seasons, you know, if they live in a very airtight house like a passive house, you are drooling about our technology because our machines, because in reality, you're able to breathe almost normally because the MERV 15 captures about 90% of the wildfire smoke particles. Wow. This is how, if, how much effective it is, you know? Yeah. And it's, oh, by the way, finally, one final thing, very important. We we have announced four months ago, Ryan, a refurbish program, a, a refurbishment program where, because our machines are made of durable materials, like the enclosure is made of aluminum. Uh, we're using, you know, only stainless steel hardware or rivets, you know, and copper, that kind of stuff. So just like an airplane in 15, 20 years from now, if we're still able to get the parts from the manufacturers or suppliers, we'll gladly be able to refurbish our units for about half the cost of a brand new machine. So that, that is sustainable, you know? Yeah. So as an HVC responsible, sensible HVC manufacturer, this is what we thought from day one, those machines must last longer, you know, instead of using galvanized steel, you know, or zinc plated, you know, hardware yeah. with cheaper, but not as long lasting, you know? So yeah. in our case, we were able to be for those units. So something else to be proud of. And once again, we are, to my knowledge, we are here as an, North American manufacturer, we are, you know, a pioneer doing an, uh, with that, the announcement of that uh, the refurbishment program. Nice, yeah, just trying to keep uh, trying to keep things sustainable and thinking about the future when you build products. That's very important. So. Uh, absolutely, we've got a customer in in, in in Salem, Massachusetts, where they have 281 units. You know, uh, 
they've done a, a great a, a great retrofit job there and you know, in 15 20 years you know I'm pretty sure they'll be happy to be able to refurbish you know those units and to change those units for half the cost of a brand new one yeah you know uh, again so yeah it's uh, yeah it's uh, I think it's it's important to, to have the thinking of cradle to cradle approach you know more and more we need to be more careful about those things you know, and this is what we awesome yeah so uh, ventilation, amazing ventilation solution, thinking through kind of what we can do. Uh, it's one of the more challenging things that we face right now in our market. We know that we're building tighter structures. And so now we need to make sure that we're really bringing in the freshest air we possibly can and controlling the heat flows. Uh, Minute Air sounds like a really great solution to me. So, uh, so Alex, thank you so much for your time. Everybody go check out Minute Air uh, and uh, learn more. So have a good one. Thank you, Brian. Yep, thank, thank you for the so invitation yep. and continue your good work.